morning student i am going to teach you the same chapter chapter number 10 the quality of the grapes in the previous class i have explained you about the humility humility means not the quality of not thinking that you are better than other people dear children the same chapter i'm continuing from the good and humble leaders so come and open your page number 46 good and humble leaders believe that they are there for the benefits of those whom they lead arrogant and selfish leaders care more for their own benefits and show less care for the people whom they lead so you must have to be a good and a humble leader so you all have to be a good and a humble leader dear children according to covalence humility can be defined the first point is unflinching self awareness unflinching means not showing fear or hesitation into the dangers difficulty when means when you are uh, so uh, danger situations are coming you have to be a uh, unflinching means you have not to be fear empathic openness to other means an important part of empathy is the ability to trust and to be trusted means the people trust you and you should be trusted by others when trust exists between the individual is it allows them to take risk and be open with each other third a keen appreciation and gratitude for the privilege of caring for others dear children feeling avoid feel finally i am thankful to the people that placed their trust in us every time it is an honor or privilege to provide define and deliver so we have to learn humility is the real real jewels that comes free of cost real jewelry means the appreciates jewelry which we get by our own selves without our use of our money so as to become humble we have to learn that greed is not good and selfish people get their just deserts being kind and strengthens you someone you love and never think you are the better than the other people or some things for that comes from the other people okay dear children now what you have to do first you have to read the story which is given in your book the story title is the master's lesson and listen carefully the way uh, the short uh, way i am going to tell you the story in the story the king wants to do something for his uh, for the for his master master gave him uh, blessings and he need not want anything as god has given to him a lot of things so after a uh, uh, lot of uh, uh, insistent insistent uh, master gave a work of chasing a fly so the king started chasing the fly but each time he chase they uh, are coming back so what happened the king thought in his mind that i am the king and why i am chasing this fly the pride enters 
in the king's mind and master is the master he understood what the kings is thinking of he said to the king that don't be so proud your status of your status because what you have is given by god the king understood his fault and thank the master to teach him a valuable lesson so dear children try to become modest by reducing your pride thank you